Hi, I'm Arson Gibbons, and today we're going to be talking about aptitude tests. And aptitude is a, is, a, is, a, is a funny one, and I'll be very specific because I think a lot of people misinterpret it, they say aptitude and maybe mean something else. So I'll just be clear about what I'm talking about today when I talk about aptitude tests. We're talking, of course, about careers and in that framework of careers. And for an aptitude, aptitude test, we're really looking at what your natural aptitude is. You know, now humans are hugely adaptable, we're very versatile, we can do all sorts of things. But when we're talking about aptitudes, employers tend to be thinking about, yes, but what comes naturally to you? What's your preferred behaviour? That tends to be what an aptitude test is trying to figure out. So you can use them to help you figure out your natural aptitudes. And of course, employers have been using them for years to figure out what your natural aptitudes are. So they call them an aptitude test. Test's really a bit of a wrong word, to be honest, because it's not something you can pass or fail in the sense that you can't cram or swat or improve your aptitude in the sense that what we're looking at is your natural aptitude. Now, again, humans are hugely adaptable. We're very versatile. Um, but just because we could doesn't mean we should. And this is really the subtle difference, but the critical important difference about aptitude. So when you're looking at doing an aptitude test or you know, some personality test or psychometric test is another word that's commonly used. These are kind, kind of used interchangeably, not always correctly, but you, you get the idea. You need to be, you, what you're looking for really is the, the core thing that is you and what you can do most naturally without really having to try. Now, in the same way as I write with my right hand, I kick a football with my left foot. I don't know why that is a bit weird. I can write with my left. If I broke my right arm tomorrow, I would probably be able to write with my left. I could adapt. I'm, you know, I'm a human. I'm quite adaptable. I'm quite flexible. However, my preferred natural behaviour, the most natural thing that comes to me, would be to write with my right hand. It's my, what I can do. I could write with my left, but it doesn't mean to say I should. So that's the difference. So when you do an aptitude test, that's kind of what you're testing. That's what employers are testing. So don't drive yourself crazy trying to improve on something or get better at this. That's kind of missing the point. You have enough qualities already. You just need to know how and where they should be best applied. I'm Martin Gibbons. That's my top tip for today. Today we've been talking about aptitude tests. And if you go over to careerpsychometrics.com, there are free aptitude tests there that will help you figure out what you have a, what you have a natural aptitude for. And that really should be the bedrock of your career development. I'm Martin Gibbons. Thanks very much for watching. We'll catch you on the next one.